Good morning, everyone, and thank you for starting your day off with us. I'm Jenna Stauffer alongside Tom Oosterhout. Oh, Tom, Jenna, you are back. I am, I am back, baby. So I am happy. back, and I've got back. Yes. So, hey. <laughs> you are back and better mm. than ever, Tom, right? You know, it's so amazing. I never saw it coming, but back in July, my back went out. I went to the doctor, the neurosurgeon, and he says, your spine has collapsed. We got to yank your old spine out and put a titanium spine in. I turned white because I, I did, never saw it coming. Yeah. But anyway, to prevent total paralysis, I had to jump in the hospital. And I was in the hospital a month. I had an eight-hour operation, and it was really scary. And uh, then, of course, the first week or two, I was knocked out. And then, you know, I was in the hospital a month recuperating. And then um, I've been home a couple of weeks now, mm -hmm. and I'm already going to the physical therapist, learning mm -hmm. to walk again. Mm -hmm. And uh, they say, I'll be back on my feet good by Christmas. But in the meantime, I'm getting around. Mm -hmm. And I did uh, the Kids Day in the Park at Fantasy Fest the other day. And I mm -hmm. got one of those little electric wheelchairs and zoomed up and down Duval Street uh, during Fantasy Fest. So mm -hmm. I caught some stuff. You'll see it in this week's Calm Color. Well, you are doing wonderful, Tom, because you this was such a serious surgery that you had. Oh, yeah. So yeah. Serious. Well, actually, the eight-hour surgery, I never thought of this. It wore my heart out. My heart actually stopped and went to deep defibrillation at one point. Oh, and then my nice. kidneys kind of went out. And then so just last Monday, did my heart snap out of it and go back into a normal rhythm mm -hmm. uh, thank god and then now i got to go get to the kidney doctor to make sure my kidneys are falling back in place mm -hmm. and in the meantime i go to the physical therapist about three times a week mm -hmm. to uh, learn to walk again and wow. uh, that's rough too yeah, having to learn to do that all over again oh, I know. but tom again i when I saw you walking in today, it was so good <laughs> to number one see you, and then number two to see you doing so well. Yeah, well, look, I lost well. 25 pounds, yeah, and uh, you, you know it's a hard way to go to do it, but uh, <laughs> we wouldn't recommend that. No, diet, that right? I never, <laughs> never. You know what it was? I hated the hospital food, so I just mm -hmm. stopped eating the last two weeks, and mm -hmm. of course right, now so I'm having to learn to eat again. Right. I'm eating like a bird, but uh, anyway, is your appetite? Doing, you don't really have an appetite? Or? Not at all. Yeah. And, uh, Will that just eventually come with Yeah, that eventually is, you know, because I eat a little more each day, I guess. Mm -hmm. I think I do anyway. So, uh, so, Tom, the big question is, how in the world were you able to be laying down for so long? Because you are always, always on the go. Well, right? I told the doctor, Dr. Chris DeMassey, by the way, an amazing, amazing neurosurgeon. He and his partner did eight hours on me and rebuilt my back. And on top of that, they use the newest high technology to sew me up, this stuff called super glue. So I'll have little, if any, scars left mm -hmm. from my operation. I mean, it's just so amazing. But I told him when I was going in the hospital, I said, you know, I'm very active and hyper. Mm -hmm. I said, a word to the wise, you better keep me knocked out. And he did. Mm -hmm. uh, the first week I was morphined out, and then, mm -hmm. you know, gradually they came down from that. But... Um, they did a good job of keeping me knocked out. And of course, I, it was up at uh, the Memorial Regional Hospital in Hollywood, Florida. So mm -hmm. thank God not many people came to see me. You know who came to see me? Randy Roberts. Oh, I mean, he is such an angel. People have no idea what an angel he is. And mm -hmm. Jacqueline Lorber from the Key West Symphony, she came up and even scrubbed me. Oh, and uh, so, so you, had a good, you had a good support group. Mm, well, they stopped by, and mm -hmm. I mean, it, that was about enough, you know, because mm -hmm. when you're in a hospital, you're not looking your best or feeling your best. It's not like you're saying, oh, come on, everybody. Right. So uh, right. You're not really mm -hmm. wanting too much mm -hmm. company. Mm -hmm. Right, right. But the great thing now is I'm sitting here with a brand new titanium back, and I'm not on one painkiller, and I have no pain. I mean, wow. the, uh, the, the operation mm -hmm. was a huge success. Mm -hmm. And they're saying that like in a year's time, when I'm fully, fully back to myself, that my back will be stronger than it ever was because mm -hmm. I now have a titanium back. So uh, That is so good. And now, not a lot of people get this procedure done, do they, Tom? Is it kind of a I, I, I never heard of it before. Mm -hmm. In fact, I didn't know they could replace your whole back, but uh, they did, and I'm living proof, mm -hmm. and I feel good. And uh, I will soon be walking again mm -hmm. and all that. I can walk with a cane or walker. But uh, right. anyway, um, you know, uh, it's just amazing. Mm -hmm. But no, I have not heard so I many, not an eight-hour operation that I have because mm -hmm. I had the Lollapalooza back mm -hmm. surgery. I mean, it was a whole 
you know, spine. So. But he is back, and he, like yes. I said, he's better yes. than ever. He is out with his camera already. And Tom, yes. we're going to take a quick break right now, but at the end of the show, you're going to give us an update on everything that's happening. Oh, so much is happening. <laughs> Season is here. Season, Season is, is here. here. Thank goodness. Yeah. We're going to take a quick break right now. We'll be right back. Mm. Stay with us.